Hey, this is Aaron Morris, and in this video, I want to share with you an exercise called Your Best Self. Uh, it's a very powerful exercise that's going to help you get the very best results um, in your life, with your care, and in general, just to have a better, happier, more healthy life. So, um, it's really based on the principle that we need to be focused on what we want in our lives instead of what we don't want, and um, that's a big issue. And most of the times, people come in to see me and they have a health issue, and they have pain or they have some symptoms that are bothering them and they're very focused on wanting to get rid of that. And what we want to do is we want to focus on what you want in your life instead of what you don't want. Um, and the way that we do that is by changing our focus, and by changing the questions that we ask. So there's a couple of questions that I'm going to have you answer. Um, and a lot of this work is based on what I've seen in the last 20 years as a chiropractor. Um, and being completely obsessed about personal growth, um, changing habits, how to change our state, um, as well as combined with chiropractic, and it works really, really well to help you get better results faster. Um, so what we wanna do is ask ourselves three questions, and the first one is, what specifically do I wanna change in my body and in my health? So what specifically do I wanna change and improve in my body and in my health? And we wanna focus on that in positive, so it's not um, I want to get rid of my back pain. I want to get rid of my um, headaches. It's I want to have a healthy spine that feels great and allows me to do whatever I want, whenever I want. So we're going to try to make these positive statements and have a clear focus as to what you want. Second question is, um, what do I want to get back to? What activities do I want to get back to in my life once I've started feeling better? Be specific, so whether it's getting back to doing some sports or spending more time with your loved ones or whatever it might be, having increased focus so you can perform better at work, whatever it might be, just some clarity around that, what you want to get back to. And then the third one is your emotions around that. How will that make you feel once you've already, once you've got that? So once you're feeling better and once you've got back to the things that you want to get back to, how is it going to make you feel? And a lot of people will say stuff like relief, um, gratitude, joy, stuff like that. And try to get a very clear emotion for you, what's real for you, how you feel when you get back to all that stuff. And so the whole point is what we want is a very clear focus. And Joe Dispenza calls this having a clear focus, a clear intention and an elevated emotion. And so if you don't know who Joe Dispenza is, get his stuff, he's awesome. Um, and it's all about in that clarity, we start to focus on what we want and then the emotions that we put out there help bring it back into our lives. So this is what you're gonna do. Once you have those three things, those three questions answered, send it to me in an email or a WhatsApp so we can look at it together, okay? And then what you're gonna do is twice a day, at least twice a day, in the morning and then the evening. So when you're starting your day um, and then before you go to bed, that's when our mind is most susceptible to change. And we're going to have you, I'm going to have you lying there, take about five minutes, close your eyes, breathe nice and deep, and just imagine like you're watching a screen in your mind and you're seeing yourself feeling better. You're seeing yourself doing the things you want to do and feel it. Try to feel ahead of time. Try to rehearse the feeling of joy and gratitude and love for the things that you're getting in your life and the improvements. So do that in the morning and evening and you'll be blown away at how fast you, know, you improve, especially when you combine this with getting adjusted. It's incredibly, incredibly powerful. So enjoy that and let me know how it goes. And I look forward to reading your responses to these questions.